Hi guys, so I have amazing news. My Nespresso machine got here. So I ended up returning the other espresso machine that I had because it just didn't work out like the way I wanted. It honestly tasted like worse than regular coffee and it just didn't taste like espresso. So I researched and I decided to just get an espresso machine instead because that's like, I make iced caramel macchiatos and lattes and I search people like doing it with an espresso machine. So I ended up getting an espresso machine and I'm pretty sure it's called the Virtual Plus and I got it in gray. So I'm in unboxing right now and I've already like opened the box a little bit. There are two, there are 20 capsules in there, but I ordered that separately. So each capsule was a dollar. I did it on the Nespresso website too, by the way. And it was a great deal because I got everything for like $1.39. So it's just such a good deal. But I will tell you guys the exact details. This is a rundown of how much each thing was. The Virtual Plus machine in gray was 112 The 20 capsules double espresso, which came in 10 and 10 Double espresso scuro, double espresso chiaro, 20 bucks in total. The recycle bag was free. The coffee sample was free. And also the shipping was free because it was over 35 This is what the Nespresso sheen looks like. I got the Nespresso Virtual Plus, like I said before. And this machine, that's what it looks like. I hope you guys can see that, but this Nespresso, it has five cup sizes, which is 40 millimeters, 80 millimeters, 150, 230, and 414. And then it has three different capsule sizes. And then it has the Technology Centrifusion, which I will, like, explain it more, but I'm pretty sure that's, like, how like it throws the capsule when you're done into this little bin the centrifusion technology is how the machine reads the capsule the barcode here it reads it so it knows how much water to infuse the capsule with so that the coffee can taste perfect and not have too much water in it or too little so it has the perfect taste in the end but yeah i just wanted to tell you guys that if you're looking on buying this So as you guys can see, this came with 11 capsules, and I was not 100% sure if it was going to bring it, but it brought 11 uh, capsules of roast and ground coffee, one capsule of the de decaffeinated roast and ground coffee for the Nespresso system. So that is amazing. I'm definitely going to try those out. Oh my god, I'm so excited, guys. It's so nice that they added this part of it. I, was, I wasn't sure that they were going to add that, because I've seen like people say that they added it, but I wasn't sure. If it's like on a specific machine but that is so sweet of them oh my god i love this and let me just take this off this is oh this is like the little i don't know what it's called filter tray okay 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 that makes sense there oh i should not broke it like that because if the machine doesn't end up working out i do need to keep this box so i cannot break this box so okay Okay, so this is the water tank. So let me take this off. In the screen, I'll just put like the um, specific details of the water tank. Of everything. I love the little top. I don't know. I love it. And then, I don't know. This just seems like great material. Very nice. And also like the actual little filter thing is really nice as well. I love this. Very nice. So I'm just going to put this back neatly just in case. I really hope I don't have to end up returning it. I did read the policy and the policy is that you have to return it in its original packaging. So I just want to do that. These are also the different um, cup sizes they have. And these are like the different um, type of capsules that they have as well. So it shows you the auto, the coffee slash mug, the double espresso, which is the ones that I got. Just espresso, which is one shot, and the Grand Lungo. These are the 11 capsules that the machine brought. And then these are the 20 capsules that I brought separately. This is the double espresso Chiaro. It was 10 bucks because I got 10 of them. And then I got the double espresso scuro, which was also 10 bucks because I decided to get 10 of them as well. But you can literally get up to 100, I think even more. But then this is original uh, coffee samples. I don't have the original machine, but this is a coffee sample that I got for free. These samples can only be used with the original machine, not the virtual. 
Here I'm showing you how to put the cup support on the machine. So to put it in, you slide it in the slot and you push it down. To take it out, you push it up and you slide it out. And this is so you can put it at any level you need depending on your cup size. This is the user manual that came with the machine. So if you guys need any further instructions, you guys should definitely use it. It's so helpful and it's in English and Spanish. So to turn on the machine, you can either just push up the lever like I did, or you could just push the button on the top and there's going to be a green blinking light. And that means that the machine is heating up. But once the green light becomes steady, then you can push up the lever again and that will rise the machine so that you can insert your capsule in that hole right there. Make sure to wash the water tank and the cup support thoroughly and dry it as well before using it to make sure it's all clean. And then I added some water into the water tank. I put about half here, but then later on I also put more just to make sure that I have enough water because this cleaning process does need a bit of water. I also wanted to mention that I love this machine so much because you could slide the water tank to whichever side of the machine you want it. It's perfect. So to start the cleaning process, what you do is you tap on the button on the top three times in a matter of two seconds and a red light will start blinking like this and there's gonna be a lot of loud noises. Don't get scared like I did. It's normal. A lot of water is gonna come down so make sure you have mugs ready. Um, I as you see here, I switched out the mug right away just to make sure. And there's going to be three rounds of water coming down. It's just cleaning the machine perfectly. Hey guys, so I really hope this review helped you guys decide if you guys want to buy this um, an espresso machine or not. There are many different espresso machines, but this is the one that was in stock for me. And honestly, at the end of the day, I'm glad with it. Obviously, tomorrow you guys will see the official espresso review of my coffee that I'm making, which is espresso, the double espresso. I will obviously show you guys that tomorrow, but you guys will see the official review. But yes, it was such a good price because I did get it on sale. So I do recommend that you guys wait for a sale because the Nespresso website, they have sales so many times throughout the year and they're such good sales. So I definitely recommend waiting for it. And yeah, it, just, it's, it was just such a good price. It was $139 in total. And what I got was the machine, which was the Virtual Plus in gray. And I got it in, um, it brought 11 capsules which is amazing. I did not know that was going to happen, but it brought 11 capsules so you can try them out or you could just use it in general. I got the 20 capsules separately, so 10 and 10. It was a double espresso scuro, I'm pretty sure it's called, and then the double espresso chatio, something like that. And then I got the recycle bags and that was free. And then I got the free like uh, sample, which I'm pretty sure that's because like I'm a new guest. So that was part of it as well. And I'm trying to think of what else. It brought like the little booklet, the little welcome booklet because I was like a new guest again. And yeah, it was just such a good price for all that. Obviously, the downside of this is that it will start getting expensive because I do have to buy the pods because it's specific pods or let me say capsules. I'm so sorry. I'm so used to um, my Keurig that I have, but capsules, let me say it's specific capsules. So that will get expensive, but it is a dollar per capsule and you have to buy 10 from what I remember. So I bought 10 and 10. So it was 20. So 20 bucks for 20 capsules. It is a good price, but obviously it's more expensive than a Keurig, which is what I originally had. So doing this was honestly more expensive. But I feel like if the coffee tastes good, honestly, I feel like it's worth it because I tried the other espresso machine, which I'll add the clip in right now. It was a different espresso machine. It was more like you have to do it manually and that stuff. So I'll add that clip right in. machine is more like you have to do it yourself and it was like kind of harder because obviously I'm not a barista so I'm not really sure how much of what and I tried my best like directly of exact measurements and it still didn't work and I even grinded the beans that still didn't work so it was like so chaotic so I just ended up getting this I did a lot of research I went on TikTok and all this stuff and I saw so many people using the espresso machines. Everyone had different ones, but this is the only one that was in stock. So tomorrow you guys will see my official review of my coffee and how it tastes. And I'm hoping for the best. Oh my God, I cannot wait. I have school tomorrow, so obviously coffee is going to be needed. And yes, but I'll see you guys tomorrow morning and I'm hoping for the best.
hi guys i just wanted to mention that this is how you put the capsule inside of the machine and then this is how you also close down the machine and to start up you just press the button on the top and after a couple seconds it will start pouring down like this When the coffee or espresso is brewing, the green light will be really fast spinning around and once it's done, it will just be a steady green light and that means you can take off your cup and obviously you'll see that there's no more coffee pouring down. Another thing that I wanted to mention is that a lot of people care so much about the crema from the espresso when they make it and this machine builds up so much thick crema. It's like creamy. It's so perfect and I was so excited. I was like, oh my god. I usually never looked at it but then when I was looking at so many reviews, about Nespresso's, about like every espresso machine when I was researching. So many people talked about it and so when I got this machine, I just realized it right away. But it was amazing and the coffee tasted so good. An amazing feature about this machine is that when you open it up, if there's a capsule in there already, it would just throw the capsule to the back into the garbage bin and the max amount of capsules that the garbage bin can hold are 10. So once you reach the limit, you can just throw into the little recycle bag and the address it has on the back. And also to turn it off, you just hold it down for about three seconds and the little green light will turn off and that's how you know it's off. I really hope that me trying to explain the uh, review more really does help. And if you guys have any questions about the machine, please comment them down below and I will love to reply to them. Thank you all so much for watching. Stay tuned for next week's video. And if you like this video, please give it a big thumbs up and comment down below any questions you have about this machine and comment down below any other video ideas you guys would love to see because I would love to film them. See you guys next time. Bye.